Dr. Gregory Horton here, three-time Olympic medalist and world champion in track and field. Thank you all for subscribing to this channel. You know we cannot do this without you. So if you have not subscribed yet, please go ahead and do so. We will continue to share valuable content to inspire, motivate, and to educate. Today, we're going to talk about Omar McLeod because to many people, I uh, think they are disappointed that he has left Tumbleweed. But at the end of the day, I want you to look at it his way as well. You know, as an athlete myself, I have been through the ups and downs. And I know that when you are at a standstill in your career, you are looking for a better way. And I'm not speaking for Omar McLeod, but I know that we as spectators should not take this personal because at this moment, I can bet that he is going through a lot and he may just need some time to think about what he needs to do, which I would already assume that he thought about it and felt that it was in his best interest to find somewhere else to jumpstart his career. Now, a lot of people don't know that Omar McLeod, very talented athlete, and that he is the first Jamaican schoolboy to run sub 50 seconds in the 400 meter hurdles which means that he has the mind of a champion it means that he is not afraid of work because he used to run consistent 400 meters 4x4 400 meter hurdles and 110 which means that he is mentally tough so i wish him all the best in all he plans on doing now, I am sure, very intelligent young man, and I am sure that he thought about possibilities and options that would be in his best interest. And I think that he would take the right approach in making the decision. We need to support him on this. I really hope that the timing is not bad for him, but... When you make a move like this in February per se, it still gives him enough time to relocate if he's going out of state. It still gives him enough time to get his thing together so he can actually get started for the outdoor season. Outdoor season actually begins the end of March, so he has enough time to get it together. So wherever you are, Omar McLeod, I wish you all the best in all you do. Continue to put in the work. Continue to stay focused. And with time, you will achieve your highest potential. Thank you all for listening. I appreciate your support. Once again, if you have not subscribed to this channel, please go ahead and do so. I am Dr. Gregory Horton. Have a blessed day.